subscribe to my channel now remember to subscribe to my channel see you hi welcome to my youtube channel and welcome to my video today Today it's a video about Benny Lewis who say that he is a polyglot but let's find out and see if he can really speak all those language that he say that he can speak. First of all I want to say thank you to my subscribers and to my viewers especially thank you to my subscribers for subscribing to my YouTube channel. If you're not subscribed yet hit the subscribe button. So let's continue watching more videos of Benny Lewis. Thank you for watching. Let's continue. Okay, let's continue to the next video. I have already showed this one in Arabic and the next one multilingual San Francisco, Spanish, Italian. This one, I'm not sure if I have showed this one, but I'm thinking also about showing the second Polish video. I don't know how many Polish videos you have. Also, I'm not really sure if it, there was a real Skype video call or if it was just some fake video because you could not really see the person he was speaking with in this Polish video. Let's just take a look first at this one, Multilingual San Francisco. I cannot remember if I showed this one before, but let's just take a fast look. This one, Multilingual San Francisco. I cannot remember if I showed this one. Multilingual San Francisco, Spanish, Italian, Russian, Brazilian, Portuguese. So in less than four minutes, he will speak Spanish, Italian, Russian, Portuguese, four language in less than four minutes. Susanna and I went around San Francisco finding native of other languages and interviewing them on camera or talking about those languages more details here so Benny Lewis and this Susanna two person will speak in the video or I don't know and also they will speak to other people so how many people will speak for language in less than four minutes and why it's in San Francisco why it's in San Francisco in USA if he is from Ireland, if he is from Ireland, why? If he is from Ireland, why is he in San Francisco? Why he make interview also with New York Times, same like Luca Lampariello, same like Luca Lampariello make new interview with New York Times. Why he make some interview with some American newspaper in New York Times? and why he is in San Francisco here. I don't know if he just traveled to San Francisco, but I don't know with those polyglot YouTubers because many of them or most of them are lying about what country they are from. So I don't know if he's really from Ireland or if he's really from USA or if he's from England or what the fuck, I'm not sure. Also on his website, on his website, this one fluent in three months, this one fluent in three months, his website. When he put the price, when he put the price on his website for the coaching, this coaching or for the Skype session, for a Skype session, he wrote that it cost $249, I think for one hour, no, for half hour, for 30 minutes, I think it was $249 or something like that. So it was in dollar. Why he write it in dollar if he is from, if he is from Ireland, then why he will write the price in dollars? He will, then he should write it in UK pound. Wait, let's go to his website here first. Because there's something, because there's something I want to show on his website here. 
tile turtle experience it all. I meet up with Susanna who has guest posted for this blog on the topic of language is music and who has her own side about language learning. So this Susanna also have a side about language learning. Okay. But let's first take a look here. I want to see something on his website here. Um, the course. So I think it was not this one. It was not this one. It was the other one. Um, but. Did he put some price here also or no? But it was not this one I want to see. Um, <laughs> it was on the other video where he put some price of this coaching thing. Okay, just a moment, I want to find, I cannot remember which video was it, the one where he said he did some coaching, I think maybe it was in the French or Spanish videos. I think it was the video when he said that he do this one on one Skype video call Maybe the first video here or Cannot remember let's try to find it Finally, I start a Skype. Finally, I start a Skype call to help an aspiring, aspiring language learner. More info here: fi3m.com. Hire me. Ah, here, this one, this website here. Here, this one. Can you see here this $249 per 30 minute call? This one I show here, you can see here. You can see where I mark, where, I'm, where to put this mark here. $249 per 30 minutes. Why he put it in dollars? If he is from Ireland if he's from Ireland then in UK I think they use this UK pounds UK sterling pounds English pounds why he did not put the sign of English pounds why he's not charging in English pounds if he is from Ireland and living in Ireland or living in UK why he did not put the price in English pounds I think it will be very normal to put it in English pounds or else he will put it in euro if he live, live in Europe if he live in Europe then he will put it in English pounds or else he will put it in, in, in euro if he's living in Europe then there's a bigger chance that he will make this one in English pounds or in I don't know what money they have in Ireland if they're also using English pounds so he should put it in English pounds or else he should put it in euro why he put it in dollar 
I think he put it in dollar maybe because he's actually from USA same like Luca Lampariello I think he put it in dollars because he's from USA but I'm not sure I don't know I don't have any proof as if he's from USA but there is a chance that he's from USA also in this video I showed you I'm not sh I, I'm not sure if I would sh I show it I will show it before this or after this there's some video that I I'm going to show but I'm not sure if I will show that video before this video or after this video because I did not upload it yet but if you're watching the video now maybe I already upload it but now while I'm recording I did not upload that video yet but there's another video that I'm going to upload or that I've I'm or that I will upload before or after before or after this there's some video I will upload that he made some joke he made some Ben Lewis made some April Fool joke and then he made some joke saying that he's originally from USA he said that he's originally from USA and he cannot speak any of those language like that and he make it look like it's a joke he make a joke that he's from USA I think from North Carolina and USA he make a joke that he's from USA and same time he put this one in English pounds and same time no I mean he put this one in um, in US US dollars he put it in American dollars US dollars the price here why he put it in US dollars if he is from Ireland and if he is living in Ireland or England UK then why he would put it in U US dollars I think he is originally from USA that's why he is used to use dollar as a price tag I think because he's from USA then he's used to use dollars as a price tag and also the video I was, I'm going to show now is in San Francisco in USA and also he go to also in start in the start he go to Brazil and Colombia and those countries they're near from USA there's like South America like he will go to Brazil as the first like the near countries because in the start when he just made his YouTube channel then he did not maybe he did not make so much money yet from YouTube or from this coaching thing then it was easier for him to travel to Brazil that is near from USA I think first he traveled to Brazil that is near from USA because he's from USA and after he stay in Brazil for some time then he start to make those video call sessions where he makes some money and maybe later he made the ebooks also then after he start to make more money then he travel to other countries if you get what I mean I think maybe he's from USA then he go to Brazil first make some money in Brazil by making some Skype video calls pretending that he's teaching people some language or giving them some language learning advice and then maybe he also when he was staying in Brazil and Colombia and those countries maybe he stay in Brazil first and after he go to Colombia or some countries like that in South America while he was still building up his scam business while he was building up his scam business maybe he stay in Brazil first and then he go to Colombia and Peru and some other countries in South America after some time when he start to make more money then he started to travel to Egypt and Europe after that also I want to see like here the Brazilian videos are like 11, 12, 13 years ago and the Egyptian videos how long time ago the Egyptian videos are 8 years ago the Egyptian videos are 8 years ago and the videos in Brazil are how many years ago I think they're like 11 12 years ago like that 
or 13 years ago 10 10 years ago maybe let's see here um, where is the video espanol you can see the brazil the videos in brazil the videos in brazil is 13 years ago so first he stay in brazil and colombia and peru and those countries and make those kind of video calls to make money and I don't know when he made his ebooks what year so first he go to Brazil and those countries near from USA so maybe he's from USA and then he go to Brazil and Colombia and Peru that is South America because he was in I think maybe he's from USA then he traveled to South America first and make those Skype video calls to make money and after he will go to Egypt and Europe after that and also here the, the videos in Spanish and French let's see what year videos in Spanish not the one in Brazil I want the one where he say that he is in Europe here that he is in Netherlands in Amsterdam Amsterdam 10 years ago so first he go to South America, then he go to Amsterdam. Also 10 years ago. The two videos in Amsterdam 10 years ago. And then also this one is also, he say that it was also in Amsterdam. No, this one is in Brussels, in Brussels, Belgium. But Belgium is near from Holland, so I think he go to Holland and Belgium, but this one is eight years ago, so maybe it's not the same vacation, but he could have done it also ten years ago, but just upload it later. Hola. Look, this one is ten years ago. But this one, I think this one is in... Let's see here. I sat down with my friend Genevieve from Montreal, Canada, and interviewed her on Francais to understand the history. Blah 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 blah. Important note: there is mistake in the video suggesting that blah blah blah. Here, Genevieve and I were speaking in French during her visit in Amsterdam. So this video was in Amsterdam in Holland. So he go to Holland 10 years ago. So I think maybe he's from USA. Then first he go to first he go to Brazil, then maybe Colombia and Peru. And after he made some money when he was in Colombia and Peru, when he was in I think when he was in Brazil, then he started to make the YouTube videos pretending to speak many to pretending to speak like when he was in Brazil, then he pretend that he learned Portuguese and Spanish and like that and French and after Arabic. If you look his first videos, like first few videos, just some bullshit nonsense. And then here, 13 years ago, Carnival, Portuguese video, English video, Francais video, Castellano, Brazil, English. Portuguese, Castellano, Francais. So he adds some language here in the start. Some videos where he adds some language to make people believe that he can speak different language. So people will believe that he can speak Portuguese, English, French, Castellano, Portuguese again here. No, oh, like English, like he put the Portuguese and English and French. Portuguese, English, French, and then also he will add this Castellano and and then after he will add more videos, maybe some videos also in Spanish here. Here he, he will make the Spanish video also. Spanish video and then he will make some Italian video also. Esperanto video, this like 13 years ago. And then he will add also more Spanish and Portuguese, Italian and French again and Esperanto. 
So we add like four, five, six language here in the start to pretend that he knows this language. And I think all that time he was maybe he was staying in, in Brazil when he made those fake videos. And then maybe when he was staying in Brazil, he also started to make his Egyptian videos in Brazil because he said first he was learning Egyptian or Arabic when he was in Brazil. So he, he pretend that he can speak five or six or seven language while he was still in Brazil. And then he start to make some Skype video call to make money from people. And then after that, he will use that money to go to <coughs> Amsterdam and Belgium. And after he will go to Egypt also and go to other countries like that and go to Poland. Then here also you go to Thailand maybe or no, I'm not sure if it's in Thailand, but it says the five tones of Thai, the five tones of Thai 11 years ago, getting by with Thai. So first he go to South America and then also he will go to Thailand after South America, maybe he go to Thailand or I'm not sure if it's in Thailand or not. But it might, I don't know if it's in Thailand or if he is in, still in Brazil here. Looking at the tone style rather than it being a how to video because I do. I'm just taking a look to understand what he was doing, like just to see here. Look, after seven weeks in Thailand, I still couldn't speak any Thai, so I decided to really try and work hard to learn enough of the basics, basics to buy things and get by in a restaurant and introduce the language, the video. I learned all of this in just one day, really. Ah, shut up. Fuck shit, man. He stayed there for seven weeks, but he wants to tell us that he learned how to speak in one day. Two thousand ten. Okay, so first he go to Brazil, and after he will go to Thailand. And I'm not sure when he was in Brazil if he also go to Colombia and Peru that time. And then here. He will, he will make some videos in Ireland after that. Ireland videos. Okay, if he is from Ireland, why is his first videos in Brazil, not in Ireland? Doesn't that seem a little bit weird? Oxford Steel Street Property Benson Dancing with a Frisbee on his head. Wait. Just want to see if this, this videos. Wait. Okay, so this one, New Year 2008 in London, London, UK. Maybe he is from UK. But I don't know if he's from Ireland or if he's from England. Oxford Street. Let's take a look on Google. I think this Oxford or this one. Oxford Street is in England or Ireland or what country? I think Oxford maybe it's in, not sure. Let's try to look on Google. I cannot remember where is this. And what about this one? 
but here it doesn't say where he is but they're speaking like they're speaking some English nonsense I can't believe that this is how your channel started this channel started with some nonsense bullshit only my romance languages this was in Montreal okay so his first video is in Montreal in, in Canada why his first video is in Montreal in Canada if he is from Ireland this seems a little bit weird right How many languages did you know at that point? <laughs> Hamza the linguist. Let's see if this is also some fake nonsense channel. My list of languages that I want to learn, <laughs> yeah. Chinese lesson, German resources, German resources. <coughs> My Nor Norwegian heritage, really? Korean church. Okay. German, okay. How to learn language, language part two and some shiny sweaty or something bullshit nonsense english german and danish letters really language learning technique learn while you sleep and <laughs> learn while you're sleeping yeah yeah while you're sleeping you will learn oh, just shut up you fucking clowns man Esperanto, Esperanto, blah blah, nonsense, bullshit. All the bullshit, nonsense people, they want to, they always communicate to each other. Videos about language learning, linguistics, and polyglottery. <laughs> yeah, polyglottery. The limits of my language mean the limits of my world. Ah, bullshit. United States of oh, fuck shit, man. United States of fuck shit. Lawusho, Steve Kaufman, Loki, and Tony Lauder. All the scammers there. Richard Simcott, Polyglot Conference, Benny Lewis, Luca Lampariello. Just bullshit. But here he say that it's in, in Montreal. Only my romance languages, this was in Montreal. So his first video was in Montreal. I think Montreal, that's like in Canada or something like that, right? So why his first video is in Canada if he is from Ireland? If he's from Ireland, then why his first video is in Canada? And after this one, Oxford Street, that I want to look on Google. I think this Oxford, I'm not sure if it's in England or where. Okay, so I looked and to be sure and I see that I see that uh, Montreal is in uh, Canada Montreal is in Canada and then this Oxford Oxford Street is in UK so I think he just traveled to UK on vacation or something like that maybe he's from USA or Canada 
or maybe he's from USA and then he traveled to Canada and after he traveled to England or something like that and if he is from Ireland or England or something like that maybe he traveled to Canada I don't know just okay which part of London is Oxford Street? Oxford, Oxford Street is a ma major road in the city of Westminster in the west end of London. Okay, Westminster. So he go there for the new for the new year, because the next video is also New Year in London. So this one is in London, England. This Oxford Street. So Montreal is in Canada. So why he was in Montreal in his first video if he is from Ireland. He said that he's from Ireland. Why the first video is in Montreal unless he go there just for vacation or something like that. But maybe he's from USA and then he go to Canada or maybe he's from Canada. I don't know. I just don't believe anything of this what the polyglot youtubers say so i don't know if he's really from ireland or if it's just some bullshit so his first video is in montreal in in canada his first video on his youtube channel is in montreal only my romance languages this was in montreal Look this abnormal word do. Look this abnormal word do. He's, and then he said that it's in Montreal. So his first video 14 years ago was in Montreal in Canada. He said that he is from Ireland, but I don't know if it's real. He just wear this kind of hat, he wear this kind of hat and this kind of clothes so people will believe that he's from Ireland and then same time he will make some pronunciation because they practice the pronunciation so he practice the pronunciation so he sound like he's from Ireland. I don't know if he's really from Ireland or if he is from USA. But his first video is in Canada. His first video is in Canada. Then the next two videos are in UK, in England, in London. This Oxford Street is in London. And then here Big Ben in London. So he started his first video in Canada and after in London and after in Brazil. So but I don't know where where he's from. I'm not sure if he's really from Ireland or if he's from UK, from England, if he's from England. I don't know if he's from Ireland or England. But Ireland is also part of UK. Ireland is also part of UK. But what I mean is that I'm not sure if he is from Ireland or if he's from England or if he is from USA or Canada. But he is from an English speaking country. Also, he said in one of the videos I showed, not in one of his videos, but one of the videos I show. In one of the videos I show, he said that until the age of 21, until the age of 21, he could only speak English. He said that until the age of 21, he could only speak English. So, if he is from Ireland, why did he not learn how to speak their language, the Irish language? But I look on the internet, it says that many people from Ireland cannot speak so much of their language. They can mostly, mostly speak English. But I just want to get an idea how he started his channel, like where he was first. Like first it's in Canada and then in England, London and after in Brazil. And I think when he was staying in Brazil, then he, he started to make all this lang fake language. He traveled to Brazil and stayed a long time in Brazil. Maybe he stayed there for 
I don't know how long time you stay, if you stay there for one year or two, three years or something in Brazil. Because most of the video there 13 years ago are when he is in Brazil. I think he, but he also has one here in Tenerife, I think, or, or it's just Google Earth, this one. I don't know if this one is Tenerife, Spain or another place. Marsado, Tejo on Tenerife. But okay, it doesn't really matter, but I just want to get an idea how he started or where he started. I think he started by going to Brazil and then he stayed there from some for some time in Brazil and South America and then he started to make some fake video pretending to speak many language and then he start to make money from that and after he will travel to other countries also but let's go back to the videos let's continue here this one Danish language skills i'm not sure if i should show the second polish video or it should continue this one multilingual san francisco first Let's try to take a look first at the second Polish video and then go back to this one again. I already showed this one. But I know I show many of his videos. I know I show many of his videos. It's because I want to, sh because he has so many videos pretending that he can speak the language. Like he has so many videos in different language pretending that he can speak all those language. That's why I want to show those videos to show that they're fake. But I did not show all his Arabic videos. I'm not sure if I will show the rest of his Arabic videos. But here I showed this one already. But I want to see the second video here. Part 2. This one is part 1. This one is part 1. I want to look here. Part 2. Okay. Okay, so part 2 is, on, is less than 4 minutes. You can see 3 minutes and 56. Okay, this looks like some bullshit nonsense. I really hope that this attempt to use whatever I had demonstrated that is never too early to try to use your language. I got nothing but positive encouragement from the Poles for my entire time there and had and, uh, and everyone was incredible patient with me. If you see me and impatient people online ready to criticize in terms of someone to use their language after just a couple of hours keep in mind that this does not represent the real world well at all blah blah bullshit fuck shit man so it's just some bullshit here also attempt to speak polish after learning it for just two hours so it's just the same bullshit i'll just show a little bit but i think it's a waste of time to watch this bullshit nonsense As you can see, even as much as you struggle and pause, you can still try to keep the conversation just in the right language. From here, I got the train from Berlin to Warsaw and was too busy preparing for my talk to start. Okay, less than four minute video and then he's speaking in English already in the start. Less than four minutes and he's speaking in English in start of the video. But the day after the talk, I had another half an hour study time to bring my total time learning or speaking Polish to two hours. With this, I met up with my Polish friend Goshka to surprise her with a spontaneous chat on camera. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey. Um, to, 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 yes, Camera? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Roz, uh, po polsku minute, minute, jedno minutę. Jedno minutę. Jak się masz? Ja się bardzo dobrze mam. Aha. Bardzo dobrze. A bardzo dobrze. Widzę, widzę Benego. Aha. Okay. Dziękuję. Aha. Co, co robisz?
Look where is he looking now? Where is he looking now? He's looking, he's holding some paper or something and looking and reading. Look this fucking fake bullshit man. Why he looked down? She's standing in front of him then he's looking down. He's looking at some paper or something and reading. He's looking at some paper or he bring his laptop or something and looking and reading. He's looking down and reading from some paper or something like that. Looking down reading from paper or laptop or mobile or tablet or something. He will only speak for like one minute or something and then he look down to read what he will say. Just some fake bullshit man. He's looking down now to read what he will say. Um, uh, so Ru Rubish, uh... You will also notice that he moved his head from the left side to the right side like he's reading some text. If you look at him you would notice that he was looking from the left side to the right side like he's reading some text. I will show it again. He is looking down now. He's looking down now. After I play the video, I'll play the video now. Then you will notice that he look a little to the left side, then to the right side. It seems like he's reading something. I will play it now. Then you'll see that he look to the left side, to the right side like that, like he's reading some text. So, um, uh, so ru Rubish, Jish, uh, uh, so, so Rubish. <laughs> <laughs> Będę pić z Benem kawę, Aha. a potem będzie spotkanie z czytelnikiem. Ok, so he go to Poland there to meet some woman. He go to Poland to meet some woman and same time to, to tell about his scam business there. Because look, the woman tell him, I will drink coffee with Benny. Or the woman say here, I will drink coffee with Benny and then there will be a meeting of readers. Of the blog in three masses, plenty or thirsty message in Polish. So he go there to Poland to make some meeting or something like that. Look, meeting of readers. He go there to meet some people in Poland to show his blog like that and tell people about his blog so he can get more people to make some video call with him, maybe Skype video call and pay him money or try to learn a language from him or something like that. He go there to find customers. Same like this pyramid shame, same like the pyramid shame or other scam, same like pyramid shame or other scam where they will go to different places and make some meetings and scam people, lie to people so they will get more people to join their scam. She say, she say here, I will drink coffee with Benny and then there will be a meeting of readers of the blog stream of the blog Fluent in Three Months. I will drink coffee with Benny and then there will be a meeting of readers of the blog Fluent in Three Months. And it will be in Polish or whatever. So she is helping him. She is working with him. Because she's the one who will speak to the people. Like he go there and meet this woman that he have talked with on the internet. He have talked with this woman on the internet about his scam business. He have talked with this woman on the internet about his scam business. His scam business fluent in three months. Then he traveled to Poland to meet this woman. Then they will make some meeting with some people who are reader of his of his blog. So he can lie to them and fool them and maybe he want to he want to become international. He want to become international that he can he go to different countries and tell them about his blog and about his scam business. Of course he will not tell them that it's a scam business. But you know what I mean. He will not tell them it's a scam business, of course. But you know what I mean. He go there to different countries. So he will make more people join his business. Or they will not, like, not so they will be part of his business working with him. But he will go there to make some meetings. 
where he will fool people, like the people who go there and, and in this meeting or conference, the people who go to this meeting or conference and watching him speaking, they will watch him speaking or this woman will be the one speaking in Polish. This woman will be the one sitting beside of him maybe and speaking in Polish and telling about his business and telling about his blog. And then maybe he will also say something in English. Maybe he will try to say a few things in Polish that he is he just memorized or practiced like that. And then you know what I mean? Like he go there to to make his business bigger. To make his business bigger that he go there and try to fool more people to believe in him. It's just like a big scam. He go he will go to different countries and then he will tell about his his fluent in three months blog and about how you can become influent in any language in three months. And this way, maybe there, even if you will think, oh, maybe you'll think in Poland, people are not so rich or like that. But in every country, even in poor countries, there will be some people who have money. And even if they don't have so much money, he will still, he don't care. Even if there's some people who don't have so much money, he don't care, he will still try to scam them and fool them. So he go there to scam people and of course there will be some rich people also living in Poland. He go there and pretend that he can speak many language and he will tell them that you can become fluent. He will tell people you can become fluent in, in any language in three months and talk about that. And then he will try to find new customers this way. So he go there to find new customers and same time when he go to Poland, he meet this woman and maybe he meets some other woman. Maybe he spend time, some time with woman. Even if he don't spend some special time or have something with this woman. But when he stay there in Poland, he can meet other woman like that. And same time, he will scam people about his scam business. He just say nom 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 nya and after he looked down. He just say a few words. Just say a few words then he looked down to read. And look she's laughing. She's laughing because he don't know anything. And look, he's looking down to read. He's looking down to read what he will say. He wants to say, oh, my first attempt to speak or second attempt to speak the language. It's never too early to speak attempts to speak Polish after learning it for just two hours. So your attempt, your attempt to speak a language is by looking down and reading from some text, you fucking fake son of a bitch. And I don't know if it's, you just learn for one hour or two hours or one week or two weeks or if you learn for how many months or whatever. I don't care how long time it is. What I care to show that is you, that you're a fake liar and fuck shit hole. You're a fake liar. That's why you look down to read. He's looking down now to read from something. Fucking fake shit hole man. And he will look down more than one time. I'll continue now then you'll see that he looked down more than one time. He looked down and say something then now he looked down again and then he moved the camera a little to the side so you cannot see his face totally. He looked down at 125 or 126 or something then he looked down again at 129 in two three four seconds in three four seconds he looked down two times he looked down to see a few words, then he looked at her, say that one or two words, then look down again to see the next two words. He need to look down to read the whole script. He looked down to read every word that he is going to say, this fake fuck shit man. In three months? Uh -huh. it's not it's not look, he's looking down to read this fucking fake son of a man. This fake son of a He's looking down to read. The woman is looking at him. You can see the woman is looking at him. Why he's not looking at her when he speak with her? Why he's not looking at her when he speak with her? He say he make 
his peak was here like that and then he's just looking down because he's reading he's looking down because he's fucking reading to all those fuck shit people who don't believe me to all those fucking stupid people who don't believe me he's looking down to read he's looking down to fucking read what he's saying if you don't believe me I'm sorry you are very unintelligent if you don't believe me you are very unintelligent he's looking down and reading the fucking text that he's saying he's looking down and reading what he is saying the whole text is looking down and reading just some fake bullshit Now he's not speaking, but he's looking down to to read what he will say next because it's very difficult for him. Because it's very difficult for him that he keep looking down. He want to be ready for the next sentence that he will say or the next words he will say. He's looking down and reading how how should I say the next words? She is the one speaking now. She's the one speaking now, but he's looking down and reading like, oh, how should I say the next sentence? Then he tried to read it, tried to read it many times. He tried to read it many times. How should I say this or pronounce this? And maybe after a few seconds, he will say what he's reading now. Now he keep looking and reading, looking and reading. And then after a few seconds, he will say what he's reading. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> Look now he's speaking but after he was looking down first. He was looking down first and reading what he will say now. What he's saying now is what he was reading when he was looking down here. When he was looking down there he was reading what he say after a few seconds later. Yeah. Look here, he was looking down for almost 10 seconds or more. He was looking down for 10 seconds and, or more. He keep looking down here, he was looking and reading. And then around 140 something, he will start to speak. He was looking down for like 10 seconds or more. He was looking what he will say next. He was looking and reading. After he will look up and speak. But he only speak to her because he is reading now. He's reading now what he will say after a few seconds. He looked for more than two for more than ten seconds before. For more than 10, 10 seconds, he was looking down to read what to say but still he could not say it and then he looked down again to read it again he, he just say one word or two words or something then he looked down because he cannot remember then he looked down to read the next two or three words like that and now he looked down again to see the next words. Now he looked down to see the next fucking motherfucking words. Son of a pro Son of a pro Scammer, son of a bitch. Scammer. And I don't care if you say it's after only two hours. You do the same. All of you fake fuck shit polyglot YouTubers, you still do it. Even if it's not after two hours, you also do like this even if you say that you're fluent in the language. Also in those videos where you say you're fluent in the language and can speak the language, you also do this kind of things that you're looking and reading or you're editing. You're just some fake son of a <laughs> He looked down every few seconds. He just read the whole thing. Everything he say, he's reading it. The whole thing he's saying, he's reading it. He look and read something, then he will look at her and say what he, what he read. Then when he cannot remember, he look down and read the next few words. Then he look at her, say a few words. Then he look down again to read the next few words. Everything they say, they're just reading from some script and faking it. 
fucking shitholes, all of those polyglot YouTubers. Look, he's speaking same time he's looking down. He's speaking same time he's looking down because he's just reading. Here he here you can see that he's actually speaking same time he's looking down. Here you will see for like five six seconds. The next five sec six seconds he's speaking same time he's looking down. The next five se five seconds or something he's speaking same time he's looking down same time he's reading. Fake shit, fake shit, son of a fake son of a scammer. And then people will tell him that he's speaking good and like this. Benny, you're almost there, really. Wow, it's amazing how much you have learned just in two hours. I hope that maybe one day you will try your three months project with Polish. <laughs> ah, fucking bullshit, man. Fucking bullshit, man. You're such an inspiration, <laughs> yeah. You're such an inspiration, oh, fucking bullshit. Benny, that's totally cool. Yeah, it seems like a like quite a challenge. A challenge to look down and read from a text. A challenge, a challenge to look down and read from a text, pretending to speak a language or pretending to have learned something in the language. Just looking down and reading from a text, you fucking fake shit, son of a <laughs> scammer. Look where he's looking now. He's looking down and reading this fucking fake shit hole. I na konferencję mówią po angielsku. Fake fuck shit looking down and reading the whole time. Fake son of a <laughs> looking down and reading the whole time, you fake scammer. You fucking shithole. You cannot speak any language. You can only speak English, you fucking son of a scammer liar looking down and reading the whole text you fake shit all your videos are fake all language you show are fake you're just some fake shit hole he's looking down the whole time just reading just looking down and reading this fucking fake shit hole he looked down just for a few seconds to read few words and he also practiced this first before the video like he will only say a few things for like one or two minutes and then he already practiced this before he make the video also because he write down on a paper what he will say in the video so he already practiced and tried to memorize it he already read it many times and try to memorize it and then he will look down and try to read when he cannot remember but most of the text is just reading it Maybe some words he can remember a little bit, but he's just looking down every few seconds to read just some fake bullshit. You like? Uh... 
podoba Ci się Warszawa? Podoba. And here you cannot see him. Look, he moved the camera. He moved the camera a little to the side. Why he moved the camera? He don't want to be in the video. Why did you move the camera? You don't want to be in the video. He moved the camera for a second so he can look down and read. He moved the camera for a few seconds so he can look down and read the next words. He moved the camera a little bit so he can look down so you cannot see him. Look, where is he? Where is he hiding? Where is he hiding? Where are you hiding? Are you playing hide and seek? Are you playing hide and seek, you son of a b Are you playing hide and seek, you son of a b He hide for a few seconds and don't show himself for a few seconds so he can look and read from the paper the next words he will say. He hide just for a few seconds so he can read one or two words or something like that that he cannot remember. This fucking son of a All the time he's looking down. I think now he maybe he's holding the paper a little bit more in front of him. Just some fake bullshit. Now he, I think he pushed the paper a little bit more forward in front of him and looking at the paper now. This fucking fake shithole son of a prost <laughs> scammer liar fake shithole. Why you look down the whole time, you son of a If the woman is in front of you, you son of a Did you not learn any manners from your person? Mother, from your mother, she did not teach you any manners that you should look to the person you're speaking with. Your mother did not teach you manners. That you should look to the person you're speaking with. Why are you looking down, you shithole? Why are you looking down, you fucking shithole, when the person is standing in front of you? The person is standing in front of you. Why are you looking down, you fucking shithole? Because you're looking down and reading what you will say, you fucking shit scammer, liar. You fucking shit scammer. You're looking down to read what you were saying. You're just looking down and reading everything you're saying, you fucking fake shit fuck. Nie, nie rozumiem. <laughs> ok, cześć. cześć. And this woman, she's working with him because she, she said that she will go to do, to this uh, meeting. She will go to the meeting and speak about his about his blog, fluent in three months. She said that she will go to the meeting and speak about his blog, fluent in three months. Because she's working with him, and then they're going to scam more people. They're just working together to scam people. She is the one he worked with in Poland. She she is the one who helped him in Poland to scam people in Poland. This woman helped him to scam people in Poland. This woman helped him to scam people in Poland. Unless she's very stupid and don't know that he's a scammer, but I don't I don't think so. Because if he was, if I'm very sure he's looking and reading from some paper, so it means that he could, that she could see that. It means that she can see that he's holding a paper and reading from a paper, so she know that he's fake. I'm very sure that like there's very big chance, there's very very big chance this woman is working together with him. She is working somehow, but if she know he's fake or not, but I'm very sure she know that. So this woman, she's helping him to scam people in Poland. So if you see this woman in Poland, be careful. There's a big chance that she's working with this fucking scammer. If you see this fuck shit woman in Poland, then there's a big chance that she's working with, with Penny Lewis to scam people in Poland. There's a big chance this woman is working with Benny Lewis to scam people in Poland Fucking shithole people, fucking bullshit scammers. 
And here's this Benny Lewis TEDx talk on rapid language hacking. You're some fake fuck shithole son of pros. Just some fake shithole. Let's see this one multilingual San Francisco Spanish Italian video here also. Subscribe to my channel now. Remember to subscribe to my channel. See you. اشترك في القناة دلوقتي افتكر اشترك في القناة اشوفك السلامة وسكت ابونيا في من قناتنا وسكت ابونيا بسيس ابونيبو اماشين من قناتنا ابونيبو ابونيبو اماشين